Welcome to today's Daily Dose. My name is Robert. That's Susan. What is happening, lady? Oh, I get to ask you that question. You're the only person I know who actually ran the breakers today, especially with his dad in a white chair. I want to hear all about it. It was great. Dad was in awesome spirits. Um, we started in a way more forward corral than I intended because there was just so many people. And all of a sudden I went from wanting to straighten it back to being like, oh, we're in like the front three corrals. <laughs> people are throwing tortillas in the air. Apparently that's a thing. Um, <laughs> so many people coming up saying, we saw your story. They loved it. Um, it was just great. And, um, you know, to be there with dad and watch him watch the world go by and kind of see what he remembered as he remembered it. And I mean, the good thing is I felt like I, I trained well enough to where this was just enjoyment. I wasn't struggling out there. I really felt good. And, oh, love that. Yeah, the haze. I love it for, you, I love it for the two of you. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the focus was on us. And, you know, the Hayes Street Hill was not that bad. It, it was work, but not that bad. And um, oh, weather was beautiful. And um, yeah, we just, you know, we it really, I mean, when it was over, I was like, oh man, that, that was fast. And oh, really? uh, <laughs> so how much could you hear him if if you t could you talk to each other i mean some but not not a lot you know i'd occasionally you know have a little strap on my arm so i could you know run to the side of him and talk to him a little bit we stopped for pictures a couple times um, that was a, so. those strap was what like uh, like a, a there's a strap on to the uh to the running chair itself okay okay yeah so you know i i could i could push him forward and you know he's not going to go away from me it, it you know gives him about three and, and he was mic'd up so if you were well, down there by well, him you know, we ended up not miking him just because i know he's not going to say that much and i'm not going <laughs> to I don't want to record an hour and a half of stuff to see if I can find three things, you know, yeah, sure. I can record him afterward, you know, so yeah, yeah. yeah uh, no. good day, huh? Phenomenal. Yeah, no, it was it was all great. I mean, it was really, if anything, it was over quick. And, you know, I was like, oh, oh, and, and, you know, and then we went to his favorite brunch place afterward. Now, getting back to the car was a bit of an adventure because, you know, I thought there were shuttles, but the ones I thought were there weren't there. A muni driver let us get on, which was very difficult getting that big thing onto a muni. <laughs> and very nice people let us. That got oh, us about nice. halfway back. And then he said, now we're turning this direction. So if you want to go to the Embarcadero, you got to get off. It's like, oh. So we ended up running another three miles back. Um, you know. She's running? Oh, so you yeah. Know, because that, that was the way. It's like, I wasn't going to, I mean, the Ubers were nuts. And, you know, anything that was a van was going to be like $100. So like, I'm not paying that. So. That's yeah. three miles. What the heck? You know, yeah, we ended up doing 10 or 11 miles, but physically not a problem. No, it was, it was, it was good. It was great. I love it. I love it. I love it. Did, so, you, get, did you, did they capture you? Did the news media see you? I think so. Yeah. But I mean, we, we stopped at the finish line, like, you know, uh, two tenths of a mile away and called them like, Hey, we're here. And they're like, you guys got done really fast. And we're like, Oh, well, <laughs> you know, sorry, we were having fun. And so we waited a little, waited like 10 minutes. And finally I was like, you know, I'm not gonna sit here with this, wait too long, I wanna go through. Right. So um, I think one of the crews got us, the other one came and talked to us, interviewed us for a few minutes and yeah, it was good. And do you know what they're planning to do with that? Footage? They said they're gonna do a post story in the morning. We'll see. Um, the reporter who was from CBS, she ran it and uh, she, you know, said she was gonna do something. So we'll record tomorrow morning, see if something comes up. And you'll share it or you'll link yeah. it. Yeah. Well, and that's why I want to get all this footage inputted because I want to send it to them and say, hey, if you want, if you need this for your story tomorrow, here's a little bit of footage that we shot. You Do know. you have any memories of like special moments that you are pretty sure showed up on your film? I don't I, I don't know that. I mean, lots of people yeah. giving us little, you know, handshakes and whatever else, but there's my perspective and then there's a camera's perspective. And I'm not looking at the screen. You know, the GoPro's got its own thing. The camera is kind of blocked by its base. So we'll see what we get. It's a fishing expedition. I, I know it recorded. That's the good news. <laughs> so you're going to stay up late tonight looking at footage. No, no. I'll get to it when I get to it. I, I've got a little bit of stuff I can send. And no, I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to work that hard on this. There's other things that need attention. Indeed. Yeah. Indeed. yeah. yeah. It's a great story. It's in the can. When we raise the money we need to raise to cut this, we will. And so for all of you who watch this, who want to see the Boys of Summer, third base, fourth film, uh, please go to the website.
you know, and, and donate. And we're, you know, we, I would love to put the, the target and emphasis on after graduation that I could, you know, do this and yes, and exercise full time. That would be great. Well deserved. Yeah. I think that's our time. <laughs> Thank you. You bet. <laughs>